Good morning, people. Good morning. I hope you guys had some <laughs> some magical past days. I don't know why I want to say that, but that is what I want to say. There might be some noise because I'm sitting in front of the window that's actually supposed to be um, replaced, but they are working on things with the wall. But it has been raining all day, so I actually didn't think that that would be anywhere going on but we're going to just work through it when i took the first two cards for today the cards the cards that came up was first of all ten of swords and six of wands again can you guys see the message the um the link between the past two readings because i can because there's a lot of release a lot there has been a lot of release happening especially again i love this with the birds and with her just having her back to the past right ready for new adventures and it's actually really going to to give a lot of rewards the spotlight is on you which i feel is very fitting for what a channel true the funny thing is that i actually once again and there's no mistake in it because i had a moment where I was like, oh man, but then I heard my spirit guide pop up and was like, it's meant to come out today. Yes. All right, someone just sent me their birth information. Um, yeah, so because I don't think I explained that correctly, but this channeling that I did was actually supposed to come out or was actually meant for Monday, but I feel that something happened on Monday that leads to today. Hmm. And I said to myself Wednesday and then I heard winning and then if I, you know, put two and two together, that is there is a lot of winning in this. I can see that the battery is blinking, but I don't know if I want to get my ass up and take a new battery. So we are going to roll with the punches and see how far we can come. But you have released so many things throughout the past weekend that we had, but also with the new. And I'm going to keep them here while, while I am reading through the channel two messages. The first thing that came through was time to do it differently, which again, these two cards just yelling, that's true. Being guided to go beyond the norm, do something you haven't done before. For some of you guys, this might actually be singing or being on stage, putting yourself out there because there is, a, I want to say, a hell of a jo journey between these two cards. It's two very different energies. Which makes sense because all of us has been going through so many things the past weeks the past months the past years so we are not the same person and you are allowed to shine out how far you have come you are yeah i feel like you are thinking in new terms of how you took on new tasks in your life something happened to you not a bad way, but something switched or something, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, it's also very symbolic, right? right? That the window here that's being um, fixed, it's like... I don't even know how to describe it, maybe I can show you guys, but it's like fist out there's no air in it anymore does that make sense so that's why it needs replacement but replacing a window right it's like the eyes are the window to our soul right so i feel like it's very symbolic that that's happening but <laughs> before the camera dies out let me see if i can show you guys all right my camera of course died out but as you guys can see it's like yeah i don't know what you call that so it's being replaced 
Also very symbolic that the camera actually died out. As I wanted to show you guys the um the window. But okay, we are going to continue with the phone because that works as well. Yes. Another thing I wanted to point out today is that sometimes when we create, we think in terms of how we did in the past in the past on something popping up here. Or we think about how other people did it or how other people do it which is also like the wrong way of creating because that you are being pushed into a higher way of thinking which is something we have touched upon the past days as well and again these two cards are just very symbolic for it you are also being very confident i will say with how you present yourself it's something that some of you guys still are working on we are still working on it but it's becoming stronger and stronger i don't know what that sound was so the higher thinking this is where your next steps lays this is where all the signs come together it actually makes sense why spirit wanted me to actually switch it up and do this reading today because of what we have learned the past days right it actually makes sense so thank you spirit and it also shows that we never take the wrong steps we never do anything wrong because it actually teaches us something even true that we feel like we are going on some kind of detour it's never never a bad thing there's also inside coming from higher realms other dimensions really look out for guidance today look out for guidance the next days the upcoming weekend i will say lean into this higher vibration don't be afraid of doing that sometimes this can be hard but i will say try to let your thoughts take a, a back seat let your spirit come out and play. Don't be afraid of it. Because we know when we open for that um, <laughs> for that sector, this yeah, spirit is fully aware of us and spirit will try to communicate in in a lot of different ways. So if you hear um things or see things, you know, don't be scared. Because I will say it happens for all of us at this moment. I will say that it would be a very good idea to just like Breathe through, like we've spoken about once again, the past days. Just be relaxed and listen. Maybe something is coming through at this moment. And just, you know, again, allow. Because the more relaxed you are, the more that you can actually control this love, this feeling of love, this the higher vibration that fills your heart more and more try to also connect with nature in a new way when it comes to using the color green so let the color green come from earth and let it go through your whole entire body and let it just fill you because at the end it's going to create this buzzing loving calm feeling and when you feel that feeling then you know that you are, you know, at the right point to manifest. Yes. The next steps isn't anything that you have ever seen, which is something we touched upon yesterday, I feel. You might not even have heard about this before, but I will say that you're ready for this. So go out there and get it. Yeah. Like I said, there's something about this being very different from what you have done before everything is very different i mean again the signs are everywhere because these two cards are very different from each other yeah very 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 different one thing that i also channeled in is that it will feel strange it will appear in a strange way and i feel that strange is actually the language you should listen to now Hmm. Also, strange is not a bad word. It's very misunderstood. Because we don't do it the normal way. The normal way. We spoke about that yesterday. And do not, no matter what happens, do not 
try to go look for this whatever this is because when we run for something desperately trying to find something it does have a tendency to hide from us so let it find you that will be a test for a lot of us but yeah and the last thing is that there is very good fortune coming your way with whatever this is which again i mean these two cards or especially this card is yeah a big sign for that but i will take the last cards there's a lot of fire um around us yeah a lot of fire with the wands that we receive because swords with the ten of swords that's you know swords are um, in our mind it's linked together with our mindset and i feel that you have totally let that go we got the tree of uh, wands yesterday and we have more fire one thing i want to say because of this is that you have um healed something from your past a childhood wound the inner child is healed look at all these colors wow also the link between the red top the heart and the cloak death card something needs to end so the new something new can be reborn you have awakened some kind of fire inside of you. Look at all of this. You have activated, a lot of you guys have activated something when it comes to travel. Adventures. Again, being out there, being seen, not being afraid. You're very creative. You create. You are the creator. I don't think that the message for today can be any more spectacular than this. So I will say go out there and be a shining light and step out. And <laughs> I feel like I'm repeating myself all the time. Step out there and shine your light. Yeah. And with that, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a magical Wednesday or whatever the day is where you are. Bye.